How many times have I stood on the podium with you, Donnie? Stood for you. One of the most visually stunning shows on television. What is it like for you to film in these stunning locations? Right there where we're sh shooting in the Bitterroot Valley. The Native Americans, every after winter was over, would move up the Bitterroot and out to the plains and hunt buffalo all summer and then come back. There was a big settlers hall formed a wall across that valley and said, you will never come through here again. So a civilization, a group of people who had been doing this for thousands and thousands of years, 60 years later, after meeting us, said, you can't come through here anymore. That story repeated itself across our country. I'm interested in that, mm -hmm. and uh, I'll make more stories about that you know, without trying to make them history lessons or trying to set the record straight. But I'll continue to make stories about that interaction, about the westward expansion. Uh, and, and I'm not ashamed, and I'm not what happened. I realized the resourcefulness it took for you know the people that were here to make a life for themselves. But there was this wipeout. There was this tragedy that occurred, and it's not talked about in any meaningful way in school. It was interesting because I've watched um, some of season two, mm. and there's a whole moment where one of the characters is speaking about whether or not she's going to speak about the history of Christopher Columbus mm. in the most honest way or not. Right. And I just thought that was really yeah. compelling. Yeah. It was a very woke moment in this series. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, we've got our own dysfunction going along. It's got our own little soap opera happening here. Yeah.